Hey everyone, Tzilla here. Welcome back to my channel, how are y'all doing? And I am back again with another toy review. Today's review will be on the Bandai 6 inch Tuck SOS Mothra. That's right, Tuck SOS Mothra. This is not the um, 2018 re-released. This is the repaint, the pink tag Mothra. This one didn't come with a tag, but this is actually the pink tag variant. So anyways, let's get to detail. So yeah, detail on Mothra is really nice. Head's nicely sculpted, her antenna, her mouth, her eyes, underside, and oops, her back is really nicely detailed. Her wings are nicely detailed. I love the detail on this, it looks beautiful. She looks really good. The front look really good. Front of her wings. Yep, that's detail. Paint job. Paint job is beautiful. I love the yellow. The orange, yellow, and the red looks pretty good. Spot on. I love the red highlights on her wings. Got some brown highlights on her back. Light brown, dark brown, and the furs are all painted brown. Look pretty good. And for the front, not much. They only did yellow and orange and black, white and brown, and that was pretty much it. They didn't fully paint the front like they did on the back. So yeah. And for her head, she's got some light brown for her antennas. Black highlights right here. And she's got some black for her mouth. And the eyes are painted blue. So yeah, detail is beautiful. Detail and paint on Mothra is spot on. And paint is beautiful. Now as for articulation, Mothra only has one. The head can rotate all the way around. And that's pretty much it. Wings don't really do too much. They just flap up and down like this. So if you want to have her flying, you could. And she is a soft vinyl figure, so she's very squishy. So yeah, that's one point of articulation. Now it's time for size comparison. For comparison, let's pull out the Final Wars Godzilla. Looks pretty good. I mean, this is how big Mothra should be, so yeah, excellent. Next, Mechagodzilla, or Kiryu. <laughs> Looks alright, but I think Mothra should be a little bit bigger, but overall, it looks okay. Yeah, I think it looks okay. Next, Final Wars Gigan. She also goes well with a 6 inch Final Wars Gigan, so yeah. Two more, Final Wars Rodan. This would be a good team up, Mothra and... Rodan. Let's do another Godzilla for last size comparison, but this time the Heisei Godzilla. <laughs> Sizing's not perfect. Mothra is supposed to be a little bit bigger compared to Godzilla. She should be like this big because she was big in the movie, so I think she should be this big. If not, then this looks fine. She looks fine just the way she is. So yeah. That's size comparison. Ending this review, detail is amazing. Articulation, she only has one. Sizing is pretty good. Figure is gonna get a 24 out of 24. For newer collectors who don't have Mothra, if you see her, get her. That's, that's the review and I hope you enjoy it. Be safe, take care, thank you all for watching, have a great day. This is T-Zilla, 
signing off.